What's up guys, I'm back again with another video. We're going to be playing Trove. <clears throat> if you have, I'm going to explain to you how to get really good power ranks if you have a new character. So let's get into it. Comment down below if you have Trove. Or if you play it. So, if you have a new character, you want to level it up as high as you can. Like, wait, let me spawn in my house. You need to be, like, you need to go to K Kandorian to get more. You need to get gems to get higher power rank because, because I only got, like, Gunslinger a few days ago or a week ago and I've already upgraded him a lot and look what the gems I have They're really good Especially this one I need But you really need um the um the gem dust whatever you want to call it <clears throat> So I'm going to be showing you how to like get a bunch of gems and I'll do it on my gunslinger account let me go to atlas and if you have um neon city I recommend it because it's decent amount of health and damage the other places are either too low or too high so I, su I suggest Luminopolis or Neon City. So let me find a dungeon of some sort, like this right here. And um, if you go in, as you can see, it's just a normal dungeon. But if you finish it, watch. There we go. You see on the bottom of where my um, energy is, the bottom of the screen, here's this little chest. You want to open it, and then you'd either get gem dust or a gem. If you get a gem, and you have an open slot, always put it on and upgrade it as high as you can. That's what I would recommend. <coughs> Ooh. <coughs> Ooh, sorry. Um, so, like I said, it's really not that hard. You just try going to different places where you know you can get the little chest. Cause that time I didn't, you see that I didn't get the thing that time. So I got a chaos chest, those are good too. But as you know, there are dungeons all around. You might really wanna go to, to the dungeons because you need a bigger power rank. Like the top, at the top left, to look at my power rank. It's high, very. So I would suggest if you guys, if you guys play Trove, I su highly suggest that you have, if you have a new character, try upgrading, upgrading the character with gems mostly because first you want to upgrade it like really high because I have my knight as um I have my knight like only on level like something I don't know what level I have him on but it's really bad like I'm trying to level him up Yeah. 
Yeah, I would. I would want to see if this video can like help you guys and in Trove if you play it. I'm not saying that you have to, I'm just saying. Um Yeah. Well, mostly you just want to get to places with those little chests. And if you want like really good loot, I I would say go to Shadow Tower. So you would want to if you want to go to Shadow Tower to get a lot of good loot, you would want to go to Shadow Tower entrance portal. Travel there from your atlas. And um you would want to go to one of these. One that's not that hard. Like these are Shadow Portal. Those are the hardest ones. I think the easiest ones are this one. Let me check. Yeah, this is the, and at the end of the dungeon, watch. Look, I'll do this entire tower thing just for you guys to see. As you guys could see, these dungeons are pretty hard once I go in. But with other people, it is really not that hard. Like, it is pretty hard. Like this. So I highly recommend you to use, do this one, like hard ones with your friends or with anyone you know, so you could get it like done faster. So at the end of the, like, at the end of the portal, you'll have to face a boss. And there's these things called shadow keys. You really want those. Because those are the ones that could open the really good, um, What's it called? Really good shadow box. And it gives you really good loot. Okay, um, geez, I got blasted high. Okay, once I'm done with this, oh my, jeez. Yeah, well, I think it's gonna, I think that I'm gonna end the video here. I'm sorry it was very short, but eh, it was fine. I was just trying to show you how to level up pretty much, so. Bye-bye.